Hello, I'm Chris Cerrito, and today I'll be showing you how to set up GZ Doom and run Project Brutality using ZDL. GZ Doom is a source port for Doom, and ZDL is a front end that makes running mods easy. All the download links are in the description below. Start by downloading all the files from the description. Once you have all these downloaded, extract the GZ Doom mod to its own folder. This is easily done by right clicking and choosing Extract To. Next, we need to make maps and project brutality folders for our map and mod files. Then extract the project brutality files into its folder. Afterwards, extract the zdlexe into the GZ Doom folder. Then, we extract the Maps of Chaos maps to the Maps folder. Finally, we copy the KDIZD PK3 file into the Compatibility folder inside the External Files folder within the Project Brutality folder. It is now time to configure ZDL to launch GZ Doom with our mod maps. Launch ZDL. First, we must tell it what source port we are using. Click on General Settings, then click the plus icon under Source Ports, then click the dots to add gzdoom.exe. Now, let's add the doom.wad file. Click the plus icon under iwads and click the dots to locate the doom.wad file. Once this is done, go back to Launch Config tab. It is time to add the mod files. We will need to add the mod files in a specific order. First, we will need to add the KDIZD11 and PB Patch KDIZD files from the Compatibility Patches folder. Then add the Project Brutality PK3 file. Then go to the UDV folder and add all the files from that folder. All you need to do now is add the PB Allow SV Cheats file from the Cheats folder. The files must be in a certain order, so I will place the correct order of the files on the screen so you can put your files in the correct order. Finally, go to the Maps folder and add the three maps of Chaos WAD files. You're done! Now launch and enjoy!